bombs here. What's up guys, James Palms here. Today is September 27th, 2017. Uh, and as you can see here, I put these in the bag on September 20th, 2017. So they've been in there for one week now. And there's my first ever Washingtonia Robusta. So you can see it. And uh, now it's uh, gonna be coming out and I'm gonna be putting it in a pot right now and uh, taking pictures and videos. So stay tuned. Growing Washingtonia Robusta here from seed 
for four years. So it's been exactly four years now since I brought the seed home, just a little over four years since I brought the seed home. Uh, Cause last year was three years. So the fourth year, this has uh, been a big year of growth in the ground. So I'm about six, six, the top of, from the ground here, uh, I'm up actually a little bit here. This is about, I want to say five feet tall, right to there, about five feet tall to the top of these uh, newest fronds here. This is what the size of them look with my, uh, I have really large hands and there's the, the petiole. They're big, they're beautiful. It made about, I want to say it made about 10 of these fronds this year. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, uh, six, seven, definitely. This one might even be a new one, eight. Maybe bit eight, maybe there's one, there's probably one more back there, about nine fronds. Um, and the trunk has expanded a ton. It, every time I look at it in the video, it, it doesn't look like it. Uh, but it's, uh, it's thicker than any of my tracky trunks out there. Uh, like on any of my other tracky carpets. So there's my hand with it. It's, uh, I don't know, quite a decent little size here. Still for four years old. Uh, not a ton of trunk on it, but lots of fronds on it. So I thought I'd do this update here. It's not in full sun right now. Um, just thought I'd get this in here and uh, might be able to put, I, I've done other videos with a can for, beside it, uh, but it's, uh, yeah, you know what? Maybe I'll go grab a can, give me one second. Well, there you go. Maybe you can see a little better there. So there's a standard 12 ounce can and there's the trunk. So pan back a little bit. So you can see the that gives you something uh, for scale. So anyways, yeah, four year old Mexican fan palm from the time I brought the seed home. Look at the petioles here. You got lots of petioles and lots of lots of lots of fronds on it. Uh, I've cut off probably three or four this year. Um, I tied them up like this. This was a very small box. I did this with a tarp for a little bit too. Uh, tell about. I don't know, I want to say right around Christmas, I, I started actually, I boxed it up sometime around Christmas, but uh, most of the time I just let it go like this and I just threw a tarp over it and I just put some Christmas lights around the trunk and that can keep it uh, going really good all the way uh, until it gets down to about minus 10 Celsius or something like that. So this is growing for three years. Hope you guys enjoyed those pictures and uh, that of it growing and uh, let's keep this going. This is an annual video. Obviously I'll do it next year. It's gonna probably gonna open another front or two here. Here's another one. Probably in a couple days now. This one here is still finishing opening, but anyways, that's how it's looking. The beautiful afternoon sun here at the very end of September 2021. So thanks for watching, guys. Like and subscribe.